berry flavored white chocolate with strawberries and shortbread crumbs. Hi there, so I got something super cool in the mail. My wonderful friend Moxie, not to be confused with me, also Moxie, it's a different Moxie, he's Moxie, I'm Moxie. Uh, uh, anyway, my friend Moxie sent me this super cool program that Kit Kat only in Canada was doing that was a Kit Kat break block. So the idea was you send it to someone during that needed a break. So I thought this would be a fun unboxing to do so everyone see what you got. So this was like a limited edition thing that they sent out to people. It came super fast. I got this in like four days. So obviously they were ready to go and just slap on the labels. Okay, so let's see if I can get it open now. Okay. So it says, this is a Kit Kat break box. It's a delicious gift for you because things have been crazy lately and we could all use a break. Yeah, give me a break from this quarantine. So break me off a piece of that. Thank you, Kit Kat. Then when we crack it open, ooh. So there's a bunch of special flavors in here. I'm sure none of them are like actually just for everything that's going on, but there is a bunch of flavors I haven't tried. So you get four Kit Kats that are just the regular flavor so you can share with your friends. You get the Ruby Cocoa Kit Kat, which I haven't had yet, so this is super exciting. Also, delightfully coffee and donuts Kit Kat, wild. And then this one just looks absolutely wild too. It's a spring shortcake Kit Kat. Berry flavored white chocolate with strawberries and shortbread crumbs. Definitely shortbread crumbs. But I will try the three ones that are harder to get. This is the Ruby Cocoa, which I think is kind of like a gimmick that the cocoa beans are red, so the Kit Kat bars are pink. So you can see the Kit Kat is actually quite pink. Very interesting. Mm. It kind of has like a fruity flavor to it. It kind of has like a berry flavor to it. I think this one is gonna be the best, the delightful coffee and donut. So I will start with the spring shortcake. It's strange they don't straight out call it strawberry shortcake. That's what it is. So it definitely is more like bespoke and they have actual freeze dried strawberries and little bits on it and it's shortbread crumble. So it really is like a shortcake cause it does have the shortbread and then it's a white chocolate Kit Kat bar. Definitely get a strong strawberry flavor. Interestingly enough, it's still like chocolate on the inside. I thought it would be all white chocolate, but it appears their white chocolate still has chocolate. The strawberry flavor is all natural because I took a bite without the freeze dried strawberry. It's completely devoid. So it's all the natural strawberry flavor that gives it the taste and it's a strong taste. Not a huge white chocolate fan. Pretty good. Last, but certainly not least, the delightfully coffee and donuts flavor. It has a bunch of sprinkles on it. And then I do also see little tiny bits of coffee. I bet this is gonna be really good. It's sprinkly and has coffee bits on it. Mm. 
Yeah. Whoa. Definitely strong coffee of taste. I like that. I kind of do get like a cakey vibe. Not like a yeast donut, but like a cake flavor, which would be like a cake donut. Mm -hmm. Obviously this is a marketing thing, but this was really cool. Um, lots to share, get to try some cool flavors that I normally wouldn't be able to try. So if you really like this, you can check out my extensive Kit Kat playlist because I have tried as many Kit Kats as humanly possible since I started this YouTube channel like five years ago. So I hope everyone stays safe and well. Keep fighting for your rights if that's what you're doing. I support you. Stay healthy and well if you have to stay home and can't participate. Check out my Kit Kat videos if you want and we'll see you next time. Bye!